it's uh, Latvian flag is one of the oldest flags in all the world and uh, it came from uh, Tesis. The church you see now, uh, St. John's uh, Cathedral, uh, is al almost 800 years old also in Tesis. And um, this is uh, one of the largest cathedrals in our region, after the capital Riga, of course. Uh, and this is the main church in, in our region. So it's re it was renovated uh, last year. So because today is Sunday, it's um, without tourists and without people on the streets now. It's very calm. And here is a beautiful place, a gallery of the Global Center for Latvian Art. It's the only one place in the world well, where you can uh, find out some artist uh, gallery and some art from the, all over the world. And it came uh, from the Australia, America, Canada. It uh, gathered all, the, all, all art things together in this spot and you can find interesting things there. So, uh, in the summertime there is a terrace and beautiful sights because today is the winter as you know and that's why there's no, 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 nobody outside. And here is a Trimpus. Trimpus is a god for beer, you know. <laughs> and uh, this is a, probably the smallest brewery in, in Latvia. Uh, and smallest and um, beautiful uh, and, and very 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 tasty beer is made here. You can come and taste in the weekends and summertime is open the summer terrace and tasting experiences you can you can get here. And this brewery is probably the mm, only one in the world which is cl very very close to the church, just some five meters to the altar <laughs> in the church or. And, and yes, very, very interesting and good thing there. So, we are now going to Skola uh, Street. And Skola, it means school. And uh, because the, uh, this street was the first school in Cesis, uh, it was 300 years ago. And, and so, it's very beautiful buildings. And those buildings are just about uh, 120 years old uh, all around. And there is a special place, Tsasumaize. Uh, it's, it's like a bakery. Uh, there is a local bread. Uh, the owner, uh, Agnes, is making some special bread from special uh, things together, healthy. And uh, you can come and just taste. Inside you can go and taste. And then bought if if you would uh, like, then you can buy, buy this uh, bread. So, and this building is a uh, Jugend style. You know, the Jugend style is was very famous uh, architect style uh, 130 years ago. About Riga is uh, one of the uh, capitals of the Jugend style, and it is also was a very rich uh, town and. It, uh, yeah, those lions you see, it's the style of Jugend style. And you know, this house has a special name. The special name is Hoppes Skyscraper. Uh, 120 years ago, uh, this uh, house was the highest building in whole town of Tesis. It was a three-storied house. Uh, because usually there uh, in town was just two storage house, it, the two storages, it was uh, the highest buildings and the architect made the building which, with the three storage house and the, the local people start to say, oh, you are skyscraper, we have in Tesis skyscraper. Uh, I'm laughing now because it's a very funny fact, <laughs> uh, but it was so. Uh, in those times about 120 years ago so and then another architect bought a land close to this building and after five years he built a four storage house <laughs> and it's uh, yeah, it, it was in those times 100 years ago it was the highest building uh, next to this skyscraper 
building. And also here in Hoppe skyscraper is a very good shop uh, with local things. And then local taste, uh, you can taste the local things. So, and we are now here close to the coffee shop, Black Schwan. And you know, the Black Schwan, we have in Zeiss, is uh, in a park in summertime, a special kind of Schwan. <laughs> yeah, and they are black. And um, the owner, it's a very good, uh, good in coffee making. And oh, it's open in Sunday. Usually it's closed. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it's very interesting that it's open now. And Kaspers is making a very good coffee, and uh, this coffee comes with specialty coffee. It's not usual coffee shop. It's specially with the very um, good coffee beans and so. Uh, yes, you can come and taste a very good coffee. No, I, I, I will show you one minute. where usually tourists come uh, can come and, and stand up and you are in the same sea level uh, uh, as in uh, Riga in Old Town is uh, St. Um, Peter's Church in, in uh, this uh, curve, I don't know, it's, uh, up to the church uh, tower this point and this uh, this place is uh, in the same sea level as at our uh, highest point in Old Riga so when Riga will be under the water, then this will be safe. Uh, but actually, it's just a story about this place. Uh, uh, but this place was for uh, things to put uh, 120 20 years ago. The people came to the church and they can put uh, there some things uh, to say thanks for a God. So at this uh, level, uh, street level, is. Uh, two meters higher than should be in historical times. So as I told you uh, that Tsaisis is a medieval town, uh, as usually <laughs> in medieval times, near close to the church was a marketplace. And this uh, square, uh, it's, uh, the name is Rose Square, but um, in, uh, some 120 years ago, there was a market, marketplace for some 500 years. There, in this place there was a market and people came to trade in, uh, because Sesis was in a Hanzetic uh, this, uh, uh, place and, and uh, then people can come and trade. And Sesis became also uh, through the east and the west the main of the storage places where the, the, those traders uh, put all things for for selling is the storage in Cesis and maybe that's why this came so popular and famous in, in medieval times so now it's just a square with all buildings and uh, now there uh, are also some uh, special markets four times per year it, it took place uh, here but it's not everyday marketplace in summer terraces there are all around are some cafeterias and restaurants you can take a beer or some eat a meal and, and enjoy the spot from here So here is a um, castle, as I mentioned, about 800 years old. Castle is with a wall around. Uh, then the town became also with a wall around. Uh, all all wall, wall around the wall. I will show you the, just one part also in the end. So Tsesis was, oh, the old name of Tsesis was Venden, actually. Yes, you know, uh, for 700 years, the name of those, uh, this town was Wenden, 
and just uh, last 100, 20 years it, uh, it takes, it's, yeah, actually it's interesting fact uh, because Venden was uh, like a from German name uh, because in this spot was the first settlement uh, Wendy lives there and from those people who live there Wendy the Germans came uh, 100, uh, 800 years ago here and they saw, start to build uh, the stoned castle uh, near this uh, wooden castle and then uh, start with the, the after the name uh, Wenden yeah. And uh, in uh, Livonian times, this, as I told, was very rich. And we are here now, in this spot. Uh, the money was made also in this uh, Livonian money, money uh, in this place. So the, the town was closed, closed with the gates. In the evenings, um, some special um, man came and, and uh, with um, keys close, uh, closing the doors. Uh, and uh, for people who can save to live in, in the new town. So it's uh, yeah, interesting to see in uh, this small picture how, how it was. And now we look at the old uh, street, how it is. So on this street level, uh, we are just about a meter uh, under this uh, level. It's uh, original, it's one of the la latest levels, how it was the marketplace there. So, I invite you to go to the main Riga street. So yes, no, uh, close to this place was um, uh, water uh, taking place, a spring. Uh, this building interesting is uh, just spring uh, water under there was uh, some hundred years ago. And uh, 120 years ago, they built one uh, building uh, on this uh, spring place. Medieval street system is still now in old town. There is some souvenir shops. It's because you know, today is very, very calm and, and so very just you can be alone in the town. And this is a uh, Riga Street, and then Riga Street uh, is uh, as usually in Latvia, the capital is Riga, and the Riga Street is uh, in uh, each town, usually it is so. <laughs> and uh, this uh, street uh, was under construction some five years ago, and uh, uh, archaeological uh, archaeologists found uh, under the street uh, the wooden street and it means that stone on on the streets is just last 120 years old but uh, before the stoned street under was uh, with um, wooden passes and so it was so interesting yes it was oak oak wood and just On the right side, this building, this one is uh, built as a hotel, but today it's uh, just with some souvenir shops and some entrepreneurs are on the first floor and some apartments. It was built like a hotel. And on the main street, we have also some restaurants, some um, shops, small shops where you can buy some interesting things. For example, here is a pizzeria, these American pizzas. And on the right side is trattoria, pizzeria. Uh, the owner is an Italian man. He fell in love with um, one Latvian woman and came to Latvia, lives in Cesis and opened this uh, becco. It's very good in, in summertime, they, they have also a terrace. All buildings on, on this main street is also some 130 years old. So I, I suggest uh, that we can go in one yard 
Uh, this is one of Zinch hotel and restaurant. It's, uh, it, 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 this building is built uh, for for new one, but uh, it looks like how it was. and beautiful like in a no no northern style and in this yard is uh, just one place where you can uh, show I can show you a place where the, uh, this, uh, around the city there's this wall and it's open just for an archaeological found one where it's popular and this yard yeah, is open for the summer for and the name of Vanadzinj, he was a doctor in the town hundred years ago and after his name, this place, uh, this spot uh, was uh, named Vanadzinj. Yes, and this is the oldest part of this wall around the town, which was like uh, for, for safe uh, living in, in an old town. And it's uh, open just uh, some years, two years ago. For visitors to see, and this is only one place where we can, you can find this uh, place. So, yes, it's a very beautiful summer uh, to sit in this terrace. So, I think it's for now for today's short uh, excursion. Maybe that's all. Maybe see you next time in next live excursions. Bye-bye.